Hi everyone, welcome back. I am here to now watch part two of the um, Kingdom Hearts Union Cross fan dub. So I'm very much looking forward to checking out um, the progression, the continuation of this story. I really hope you enjoyed my reaction to the first video. Uh, it was probably in like two parts or something, so this will also be in multiple parts. So yeah, I really hope you enjoy. Please be sure to leave a like and subscribe and comment your thoughts. So once again, I am shouting out Demo and um, everyone who contributed to this incredible um, fan collaboration. It is so brilliantly done, it doesn't even seem like, you know, some little fan project because it's not it's like an actual piece of of professionally done work by people who admire and love kingdom hearts and that's really freaking awesome so i will be linking the video down in the description um so i'm sure you've seen it before if you're watching my reaction but do check it out if you haven't and yeah alrighty, let's get into it okay previously in Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Fan Dub, Part 1, Kingdom Hearts Key. There isn't much time left. You are the ones who will remain. Someone needs to told. keep everything and everyone in order. Otherwise, the light will expire. But... I'll select four others from the Dandelions. Five of you will each lead a union, as the five of us have. You won't be alone in this. Arthur's voice actress was so good. The five of you can work Person together. Did it. Incredible. The five of us. Kingdom Hearts Union Cross Fan Dub Part 2. Here we go. Union Cross is the conclusion of the story that began with Kingdom Hearts X and X Back cover. My most heartfelt thanks again to the dozens of wonderful Kingdom Hearts fans who provided their numerous talents to bring this vision to life. Hell yeah. An optional stopping point will appear at 42.05. Content beyond that point was released after Kingdom Hearts 3. That's okay. We thoroughly hope you enjoy. This secret must stay with the five of you. When all is said and done, you must come to the Faded Land. You'll be joined by four others. Am I the second to arrive? Huh? Scold. Scold? Well, this is a surprise. <laughs> Disappointed? I, on the other hand, had a feeling you might be here. Of course not. We came here once right after the war, remember? I just thought I'd never see you here again. <laughs> this whole thing is a big secret. We weren't supposed to tell anybody. <sighs> I suppose you're right. I wonder who the others are. I don't know. Is it gonna meet each of the dandelions? I wasn't sure I believed Master Ava when she said others would come, but now that you're here... Look! Someone's coming! Oh. Okay, who else? Welcome! You're number three. I'm Skuld. Nice to meet you. Oh, uh, thanks. You too. So, Master Ava talked to you too, huh? Yeah, she said I should come here when everything was over and that I was one of the five. I got the same speech. Who is it? I'm Ephemer, by the way. <gasps> oh my god. 
Is it actually Ven? I'm Ventus. Call me Ven. It is. What? You two know each other, huh? It must be nice. I've always been on my own. Oh my God, I was pretty much on my own, then? too. I wonder why I was chosen for this. I'm not especially good at anything, and I'm never at the top of the rankings. But you're hot. I'm sure Master Ava has her reasons. You think so? I don't know her all that much. I've barely spoken with her. She's easy to talk to, that's for sure. <laughs> you say that about everyone. <laughs> what? Not true. <laughs> <laughs> I sure wish I had friends. Then... You do! Right here. <laughs> yeah. Friends. Cool. Huh? Uh, huh? You must be number four. The name's Brain. Pleasure. Brain? <laughs> okay. Thought I'd be the last to arrive. Guess I'm not so lazy after all. <laughs> I guess not. So, you the leader? No, we haven't decided any of that yet. I think we should wait until we're all here. You got it. Hey, about the rules. Think they're set in stone, or more like a guideline? <laughs> they're rules. Of course they're set in stone. Huh, I get it. You're the serious one. Like Master Ava. Huh? <laughs> You're not the first person to say that. I thought you seemed familiar. But Master Ava's so amazing! Uh, what is that? <laughs> like she's not. <laughs> but seriously, how do we know we can trust her? She's forcing us to lie to everyone, since we're the only ones who are supposed to know the truth. Damn. Yeah, I'm not sure how I feel about it either. But... Hmm... Interesting. I thought you might say that. But I wonder if you would feel the same, if you were there to witness the end. Rules are rules. I don't want anyone else to have to carry the burden of the past. <laughs> Got it. Okay. I trust you'll guide us down the right path. Same here. <sighs> Just one more. Oh, how much longer are they gonna be? <laughs> so sorry. <sighs> Not much longer, I hope. I'm gonna take a look around. I'll join you. Look. Oh. Uh, someone's coming. I hope I didn't keep you waiting. <laughs> well, you did. Who's that? How do you plan on making it up to us, number five? Number five? Then I must be the last one. I've heard that voice before. Don't worry Who's about it. it. I'm Ephemer. A scald. I'm Ventus. Call me Ven. Name's Brain. I apologize for making you wait. I was searching for something and time got away from me. My name is Lario. Lario, nice this is Malusha, right? Lario. So the, the complete person is Malusha. Is that correct? He's got the beautiful pink hair. Stand ready. Some things aren't for you to know. We'll <sighs> so he survived Where am the I? war? Are you okay? Was it all... a dream? You've been having that dream a lot since that day. 
The day Master Ava invited you to join the Dandelions. And you talked to Skull at the Fountain Square right before she went off to join them. You look like you were having a nightmare. Why don't you take it easy today and get some rest? So the war hasn't happened yet? I think I will. How long was I asleep? No longer than usual. Hmm. Good night. <laughs> Nightmares? Uh-huh. It's hard seeing Damien like that. And I hate lying. But I know it's for the best. Ooh, okay. It is. And it might be hard, but you're doing a great job. Of course! We're best friends! I can tell. Cheerthy, don't forget about your task. I won't. Union Cross, right? That's right. New Adventures with Friends is a great way to bury sad memories deep within one's heart. Okay. And we can't stand to lose anyone now. The darkness in this world is not the same as what we faced in the other one. Different? How? What? It feels so this more is the ultimate complex. one? Like there's more to it than meets the eye. Almost like it has its own will. Don't worry, we'll look into it. In the meantime, you know what your job is. Fill Damien in on everything, okay? Will do! <laughs> what was that about? There's no need to worry anyone until we know for sure what it is. I know. I'm sorry, but this concerns everyone. I get a really bad feeling every time something happens in this world that didn't happen in the other one. Ooh. This Union Cross business also feels... off. Something's not right. So it's like just before? But we were told to make it happen. It's in the rules, remember? I know, but... <sighs> May your heart be your guiding key. Dang. So this is the master's room. <laughs> hmm. Try not to touch anything. <laughs> Why not? It's ours now, isn't it? I suppose you're right. Yeah, I guess you guys are the new... Five. The new... What now? We should decide on union leaders. Uh, about that. I don't know if we should be assigning people just yet. <sighs> huh. Interesting. But a wise choice. We should keep the five unions as they are for now. The voice of, um... As for who goes where... Gloria. We'll need to discuss that in it's length. really well done. To avoid repeating history. Exactly. I don't want people being loyal to only their own unions. Doesn't the rulebook say we need to assign new leaders? Yes, but it doesn't state when. <laughs> Got it. No need to hurry then. Okay. It's an important decision. We'll need to think long and hard. I agree. Ben? Sure, if that's what everyone else wants to do. You can speak up if you don't agree. It's not that. I'm still not sure about leading my own union. At least if we all put a lot of thought into it, I'll feel more confident about the whole thing. <laughs> uh, grow a backbone, will ya? You are not weak, Ven. You're kind. <laughs> <laughs> you really are. Then Ben's so. a sweetheart. Oh, and to avoid any confusion or chaos, let's not say a word about the Foretellers to anyone just yet. That is wise. As planned, all the Keyblade wielders are undergoing their training again. It may be a good time to discuss the issue when that's over with. Alright. Okay. So in this... Hmm. 
world, there aren't the foretellers, the but there are still the mm -hmm. Keyblade wielders? They survived? I think I found our first task. Oh, wow! They're adorable! Are you these? Spirits? <laughs> yep. What better way to celebrate our own promotion than by granting everyone their own companion? Hmm. Yeah. What do you think? What do you mean, companion? Someone that'll come along for the ride. Like Chirithi. Spirits don't have as many powers as Chirithi, but they can devour nightmares. <sighs> nightmares? Uh-huh. It's hard seeing Damien like that. And I hate lying. But I know it's for the best. It is. And it might be hard, but you're doing a great job. Of course! We're best friends! So they can forget about the past. That's right. If every wielder has one of these spirits, the tragedy will be forgotten in no time. Wow. Problem solved. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Yeah. Let's do it. But do we even know how? We can make one using the arc from time, these? but... Hmm... I'll need materials. I'll stay here and get things started. You guys are going on a scavenger hunt. <laughs> Is it a long list? This might take a while. I'm sorry, but I'll have to pass. Then help me out with this. That I can do. Okay. Cool. We'll be back soon. <laughs> Counting on ya. Hi, Chirithi. <laughs> Hi, Chirithi. You're Damien, aren't you? That's right. Who's Charithy are you? That's right. This might sting a little. Huh? Ow! What was that for? <gasps> this! What's that? Did you pluck one of its... I have a present for you. A little thank you for all your hard work. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. It's your very own spirit. Spirit? Oh. <laughs> Lovely. This little one will join you on your adventure. Play nice, okay? <laughs> Thanks, Charithy. <laughs> See what's going on in the Moogle shop. You finally showed up. Look at this mess, Koopo. Oh. Yeah, damn. Water damage is serious business, Koopo. My regulars won't be happy if I have to close shop. Make it stop, Koopo. <sighs> Oh! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> Is this our lucky day or what? A new breed! Who the heck are these Focus. people? It looks formidable. <laughs> that means plenty of lucks for all of us! Nap time's over. Help us out, will you, Koopo? <sighs> Not so fast! Right behind ya! I don't think this is a good idea. <laughs> hey, wait for me. Uh-oh. Well, what are you waiting for, Koopo? That monster is responsible for this, this mess! 
Are you going to let it get away with this, Koopo? All right, Moogle, I'll go. <laughs> Woe is me, Koopo. We're so close. Oh, dang. Exhausted, Koopo. Can't fight anymore. Is it my imagination, or does it look bigger than before? <laughs> oh, gosh. Thanks a million. That was close. <laughs> Phew! Good as new, Koopo! Yeah! You're back! The water's gone! All because you got rid of the heartless, Koopo! Now I don't have to close up shop! Doesn't it feel good helping others, Koopo? <laughs> Welcome to my shop, Koopo! Do you like the new decor? Doesn't it feel like a brand new store? Tell all your friends, Koopo! Wait! You forgot to buy something, Koopo! <laughs> Why do you run screaming? <laughs> well, it looked like you did. This is strange, Koopo. I heard that a little remodeling would equal big business. Where's the fire? That's the Moogle we know and love. It's a sworn duty to collect money. Like, it's our duty to collect Lux. Money makes the world go round, Koopo. <laughs> <laughs> well, I should scoot. See ya. Let me know if you hear about anything at Saiten. It's all about teamwork in the end, isn't it? <laughs> Hooray for friends, Koopo. Hooray for friends. Oh, good job. So the and they're still collecting Lux, but they're right, you know. But, uh, it's about being, teamwork yeah. and friends. Because those friends one day they will become your power. Yeah, so it's just being stronger together instead of fighting for Lux against each other. That's cool. So are there only certain Keyblade wielders left, or was it everyone remaining? I heard that people are designed to shove all their sad memories deep down inside in order to protect their hearts. If that's true, was it really necessary to overwrite the memories of all these people? Mm. Memory shouldn't be forgotten, even the sad ones. Maybe that's easy to say when they don't belong to me. Mm. But no, that's while they can learned. be hidden deep inside, Blippi. the wounds and scars remain. Forgetting doesn't mean it never happened. Your memory was overwritten with the rest of them. They're sad memories, forgotten. But your heart still bears the scars. If the time comes, when you need to remember, I'll be right here by your side to help you. Charity. There you are. Excited for today's mission? Time for some fun. So this is the new like fun and adventure Not that so he's fast. His heart uh, is focusing work? on. I meant work. To get the sadness. Let's get this over with quickly. To not be at the forefront of his heart. That's that. You mean? Yep. Time for Operation Fun in the Sun. Oh, fun in the sun. Finally, let's get changed. <laughs> Hell yeah. Let's go home. 
now this is kind of giving like a Twilight Town, the early stages with uh, Roxas and Alette and Hena and Pence. The Keyblade holds the power of light, the power to drive away the darkness. Not everyone can wield the Keyblade. You were chosen because of the light in your heart, and now, your Keyblade is brimming with that same light. Because of you, your friends are safe and sound. You're doing good, kiddo. <laughs> Oh, and I have a little something for you. Dun, da, da, da. <gasps> oh my god, sea salt ice cream! It really is like in Twilight Town. Oh. We make a great team, you and me. Besties. Oh. So I guess this is how Ventus had his charity that he was. Very oh, close with, but um, I wish every I guess that memory like was this. removed from him. I don't you, know. You, I need your help. The market warehouse now. I wonder what's going on. Well, let's find out. Thanks for being here. Sorry that I couldn't explain things earlier. <laughs> My friends cornered a new breed of heartless in the warehouse. They've been in there for a while, and I started to get worried. Oh no. Would you check on them for me? This one's quick! It's so dark in here, I didn't see it coming, Koopo. <sighs> You're so close! Be careful! Ooh, going alone to feet. Damien! Darkness has spread to a new world. I'll bet that's where it's going. Beautiful. New worlds to explore, Pretty new beauty, princesses of Cinderella. light to protect, and new adventures for us to share. Oh, Donald and Goofy! They're here! We defended the precious lives I'm of so these happy unfamiliar to see them. worlds. And over the next several months, you and all the other dandelions completed so many missions for the union leaders. Heck yeah. Your journeys would take you across Daybreak Town, and, though we didn't know the whole truth yet, throughout all the worlds of fairy tales, hunting down rare and powerful Heartless with your newfound party members and friends for the looks they contained. They mean McDonald and Goofy! Being a wielder of light lets you meet so many wonderful people. And they all found a special place within your heart. Your fellow Keyblade wielders came in all shapes and sizes, but so many were brave, talented, generous, and kind. <laughs> Even those that put up a tough outer shell or acted in mysterious ways. You would soon realize that every person in the community had something special to offer and did their best to protect the light in their own way. Mm -hmm. Together, you would celebrate milestones, holidays, and special events, often decorating Daybreak Town to recognize the occasion. Beautiful. Speaking of occasions, it seemed like once a year, some extra colorful fellows would find their way into Daybreak Town and require your help to return home. <laughs> I felt terrible keeping the truth from you. But a large purpose of these experiences with your friends was to overwrite the tragic memories of the Keyblade War in all of your hearts. <gasps> Mickey! 
The nightmares you had been experiencing were flashbacks to your original life. Yeah, original life. I don't know why the Master wanted things to be this way. But we Chiripees and your new spirit companions worked to fulfill his wishes. And you began forging new, happy memories to overwrite the terrible ones. Again, well, there simply isn't time to talk about all the adventures you had. But, there were a couple of interesting conversations that were had in the Castle of Dreams. And the Enchanted Dominion. Something about that evil uh, <laughs> The boys in the gummy ship, Chippendale. Nice. That's so cool. Dreams really can come true, if you believe in them. I wish I could show you dreams that you would want to come true. What does that mean? Oh, because he has to show oh, um, nightmares? Nothing. Let's believe so that our dreams come true too. <laughs> I've had a bad feeling since the moment we set foot in this world. I think it's somehow connected to Maleficent. Good idea! I know you're disappointed, but I can still sense her light. She may be asleep, but her heart isn't. But... there's nothing we can do for her. Not right now. We'll come back to help her, okay? Why does the ending never alter? Because I knew you would come from the future, Maleficent. Who goes there? Show yourself! Ooh. You can call me Darkness. Oh, Darkness? How curious. It's clear why you're here, Maleficent. You want to erase your humiliating defeat from history oh. and collect the seven hearts of pure light. Mm. But changing the past is not as easy as you think. There are rules when it comes to time travel. You can only return to a time where a version of you exists. But to do so, you must first separate your heart and body. When that boy pierced your heart with his keyblade, you remembered what you learned from the old keyblade wielder, didn't you? You thought you could finally use it to traverse time. Just the way that Xehanort did. Perhaps. But the master knew you would use that method to come to the past. That's why the Enchanted Dominion was never created. In the real world, before the Keyblade War. Huh. Enough! Are you saying this is a trap? Ooh. Indeed. You see... Before the Keyblade War, Keyblade wielders defeated monsters and gathered light from the worlds of the future, seen in the Book of Prophecies. Interesting. But after the war... The Master and Foretellers vanished. And the tragic memories of the remaining Keyblade Wielders were overwritten. Yes, the remaining so the world from the okay. Book of Prophecies became unreachable. But there, within the data, the worlds were recreated.
including worlds unfamiliar to the real world. So this is a... Not a Impossible! Are you implying this isn't the real world? No. This is a world of data. Yeah, okay. What has been written here cannot be changed. Right. Uh, I see. Is, so you is. have me trapped here, away from the real world, because you feared my power. Not quite. <laughs> it wasn't your power I feared, but the act of you taking the knowledge of the past to the future. That's why only six worlds containing hearts of pure light were created here. I didn't want you learning what happens in that seventh world. How interesting. Now, what do you intend to do with me? Keep me trapped here in this data world? No, that I can't do. You must return to your original time. Hmm. But travel into the future is impossible. There is a way. Ooh. Dang. Huh. Hmm. What's going on? Oh, hey! What did you want to talk about? I've got books that need reading. I'll be quick. Where's Larium? Yeah, is Larium late again? He's not coming. Uh, uh -huh. what? Why? Then shouldn't we do this some other time? Hmm. I'd prefer if all five of us were here for this. Larium said you have his support, no matter what. Huh? It's simple. He believes in you, Mr. Leader. But everyone here is a leader. <laughs> I guess you've got a point. Well, let's get started for now. Uh, all right. You're when not explaining something. Leaders, we all received a copy of the rule book. Do you remember reading about Shift Pride? That, right. You mean the part about Keyblade wielders fighting each other? Sure. Why do you ask? Wait, Keyblade wielders fighting each other? Didn't you read the book, Ven? <laughs> ben! <laughs> I did, but I guess I didn't realize what it meant. No. Isn't it just a friendly competition? I think everyone could use a bit of entertainment. Besides, it's not like we have much of a choice. It's in the book. I know, but I disagree. Whoa, Vin. When did you grow a spine? <laughs> this is serious. I don't like the thought of wielders turning their weapons against each other. Yeah. I also disagree. Nothing good will come of it. So did their well, memories get drained, or do one. they remember? It's up to you, Ephemer. Up to me, huh? I think we should do what it says. <laughs> what? Ephemer! Lorium also agrees. So, I guess it's settled. <laughs> Not so fast, Brain. <sighs> what? I said we should follow the book. But I don't want other wielders fighting each other. Remember how all the worlds were recreated as data after the Keyblade War? That means we were also recreated as data. Okay. All of us. Oh, I get it. Get what? People don't have to fight each other. They could fight other wielders' data instead. 
That way we can still follow the rules without actually hurting one another. Okay. Right? Exactly. I can agree to that. Yeah, me too. It's a clever plan and all, but a little too clever coming from you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, well, maybe I did have a little help from Lorium. Lorium? You discussed yeah, this with him? a few days ago. Ooh. What's the matter? You look troubled. Oh, hey Lorium. I was thinking about that shift pride thing mentioned in the book. Oh yeah? It might just be friendly competition, but I don't like the thought of wielders fighting each other. But it's written in the book, so we have no choice. Why would Master Ava and the others want us to do this? Hmm... Maybe it's all just a big prank. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, be serious! Like a cycle. But you smiled. You really need to take it easy. Stop being so serious all the time. Uh, you're right. I have been kind of anxious since I became a union leader. Thanks, Loria. Don't mention it. There are only five of us, and we need to stick together. Where are you going? Well, once the Keyblade War ended, the worlds were recreated in data along with the people in them. I'm looking for someone who is supposed to have become a dandelion, but I haven't seen them anywhere. Ooh. So, I thought I'd search the data. Okay. That's worrying. Can I help? Someone who is supposed to come, become a dandelion, so that Thanks, could either be... but it's a personal matter. I'd like to sort it out myself. Damien or, um... What's her name? Salitia? He's looking for someone? I wonder who? It seems like a private matter, so let's not get involved. Not unless he asks us to. You're right. In any case, we could thank Lorium for this solution. I wouldn't have come up with it myself. Too bad he's not here to take credit for it. Hmm. So is the version of Damien just data or did he actually survive? Hmm. Oh, uh, are you Arena? Scene. Yes, Arena. I, I want to ask you about my sister, Strelitzia. Yeah, Strelitzia. Sorry, that was her name. Um, she was the, who was meant to be the Keyblade wielder. Kingdom Hearts Three was released in January 2019. Most Union Cross content beyond this point, and the video was released after that day. No worries. Although I personally recommend seeing the story through to its conclusion first. This is a fine optional stopping point to begin 0.2 Birth by Sleep, followed by Kingdom Hearts 3. srelezia has gone missing? Yes, and she mostly kept to herself, so I don't know what happened to her. Yours is the only name I've heard her mention. You two were in the same party a few times, right? I was wondering if you knew anything. Interesting. I didn't know her very well. She was on her own most of the time. We would chat about missions, but we weren't what you'd call friends. I see. She wasn't sure about joining the Dandelions at first, but I managed to convince her. I didn't have many chances to see her after that, and then I realized it's been a while since I'd seen her at all. I saw her every now and then, but we didn't talk much. She always seemed to be waiting for someone. Someone? Mm -hmm. 
She used to sit and wait on a rooftop in Fountain Square. Yeah. But that was a while ago. Remember when Master Ava gave that speech about unions fighting one another? Nothing seemed to come of it. But it was around that time. Nothing came of it, huh? These must be the new memories the they new were given. Memories, yeah. So my sister was around until before the war. Mm. She couldn't have gotten caught up in it, could she? It was truly just before the war. You really care about her, don't you? Of course, Malaysia mm. or Lorian tell, will huh? have, would have an adorable sister. I wish there was some way just to as pretty. help. Oh, maybe there is. Cherithy! Nope. <laughs> Here, aren't you friendly with Streletsia's Cherithy? Yup. Did you two ever talk about her? Hmm. You're a union leader, aren't you? This is Streletsia's older brother, Lariam. Lariam. She seems to have gone missing. Is there anything you can remember that might help? Hmm. She seems a lot nicer than Loxine. <laughs> She was searching for someone. Again, this someone. She was really curious about them, but she didn't even know their name. So they weren't friends? All I know is that it was someone who didn't talk much, but someone she wanted to invite to become a dandelion. Did you last see her before or after the bells? Bells? Oh, um, I think it was before. I see. So did the Cherithys all so remember? she definitely disappeared before the Keyblade War. Maybe this someone is the key to finding out what happened. The last time I saw her was around here. That door. I was talking to her Cherithy, but when people went into this house, her Cherithy hurried back to Sterlitzia. Shortly after, they announced the new union leaders, and that's when I recognized one of them. Skald. Skald? Does any of this help? <laughs> it does. Will you let me know if you think of anything else? Of course. Thanks. I'll see you later. <laughs> where are you going? This is where she was last seen, right? There may be a clue. Check it out. Since when do you care about others? Because he's pretty. Shush you. <laughs> when do you care about others? <laughs> okay, so maybe maybe she's still the way she is. <laughs> <laughs> Hi there. Good, you're here. I didn't realize you were gonna show up so soon. If I had, I would have waited to talk about shift Skull, pro I need to ask you something. <laughs> Me? So that's what happened. I'm sorry I can't be of any help. No, it's fine. Thanks anyway. So did she mention Damien to him? <sighs> My sister has such a good heart. I wouldn't be surprised if she accidentally got caught in the war trying to save this someone. Oh no. If I may. What is it? We know that until the bells rang, your sister was searching for this someone to invite them to join the Dandelions. From this, we can deduce that your sister, who was already a member, didn't see them at Fountain Square during Master Ava's speech. And if this person wasn't there that day, there's a good chance they fought in the Keyblade War. And also this brain guy and another makes me thing. think of Your sister Greg, was hesitant but I to become a dandelion. Sure. And yet, not only did she join, she wanted desperately for this someone to join too. <laughs> Puzzling, isn't it? I think I may know who this person is. Really? Ephma? Someone who's not very talkative. <laughs> Someone who didn't join the Dandelions. But was meant to. Yes, gold. Oh! Mm-hmm. You know who it is. Uh-huh. A friend of mine. Okay. Then the 
defeated the Colosseum. Remember each other? Long time no see. Yeah, good. I know we haven't had a chance to talk much lately, but I've been swamped. I've heard that you're doing really well with your missions, though. <laughs> you yeah. must be busy too, Mr. Union Leader. <laughs> Mr. Union Leader. <laughs> Things are a little hectic. How's school? Yeah. Good. She's been a great help. So, what did you want to talk about today? Someone wants to meet you. You know the union leaders, right? Mm-hmm. Hmm? Here we go. I'm Lariam. It's nice to meet you. Mm-hmm. I'd like to ask you a few questions. Is that all right? So it's interesting that mm -hmm. the memories of this isn't held by like Ventus so didn't recognize either, huh? Malusha or Loxine but or it anything. Did clear up one thing. That's true. Hmm. Well, I have to excuse myself. There is some place I need to be. Do you have to go too? Hmm. No. I ah. thought we could spend the day together. If you don't have anything else planned. Finally! Heck yeah! Damien. It was nice meeting you. This may not make much sense to you, but please, keep my sister in your heart, okay? Mm -hmm. Thank you. What should we do today? Hmm... Let's see. Hey there. Hi! Thank you for coming. No problem. Thanks for your help. She found out more info? I've managed to uncover some things since. That's wonderful! We actually found something too. Mm hmm. Oh? We checked out inside that building. After you left, we took a look inside. Mm -hmm. This place gives me the creeps. Me too. Yeah. Glitch in the data? W wait! Strelatia! 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 We came back a few times, but we never saw her again. Also. Also! I remembered something. Something Estrelitzia's charity mentioned the last time we talked. Yeah? She doesn't even know their name? Nope. Why does she want to invite them to join the Dandelions? Well... I can't really say much. But she wants to save them from the war that's going to... Huh? What? <laughs> Sorry, I need to go! 
Whoa. <laughs> Heard Chirithi talked about a war? Are you sure? Yes. Master Ava spoke about a war in her speech, but it never happened. That was strange. Yeah. Terezia was certain the Keyblade War was going to become a reality. But how could she have known? Because she was given a book. Your sister was hesitant to become a dandelion. And yet, not only did she join, she wanted desperately for this someone to join too. <laughs> Puzzling, isn't it? Perhaps Brain might know something. Uh, um, Ven is so cute. <laughs> uh, I love him. Spit it out, Ven. <laughs> oh, sorry. It's just that you haven't put down that book. I was just wondering what you were reading about. I knew Ephemer was curious, but Brain, you take the cake. I have a plan. Huh? What kind of plan? We're still headed for inevitable destruction. What? Yeah, it's a cycle, isn't it? And I'm gonna change that. At least it seems like... Like it's a cycle. This world is on a path headed for destruction. Overriding people's memories of the Keyblade War didn't change that. So, mm. I came up with a plan. I'm going to become a virus and overwrite the program that is this world's future. How the hell are you going to do that? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I haven't had that much fun in a long time. Aww. Thanks, Damien. That's so sweet. <sighs> it's good to take a break every now and then. <laughs> I hope we see you again soon. Of course. Mm. Ooh. These glitches. Scold? Hmm? What do you think about Brain's plan? He's called Brain for a reason. <laughs> Big Brain. <laughs> he knows a lot more about this than any of us. I just don't understand why the Dandelions needed to be saved from the Keyblade War if we were doomed from the beginning. Yeah, that's what has me I don't get it confused either. as well. Should we talk to Ephemer and see what he like thinks? This endless cycle that's I think we should. I don't know. I it's fascinating. Where is everyone anyway? Hmm? <gasps> What's that? Damn. Master Abba? Oh shoot. There no fruits. Make that ah. and lights. Time comes. Rolls. Builder gets free cop the book hole for shoes. The great don't, 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 don't you think? Oh. And it's also need to shake the world into what it's supposed to be. Damn. What's going on? What is this? Is Brain still here? Yes, he was headed to the control room. I'll get him. Control room? The heck is the control room? So, it's already begun. <laughs> well, I should be heading back. Huh? Oh. What is that? Oh boy. Let's go and find out. 
<laughs> They're the same as the the bugs that were in the dataverse. Have they made their way inside? Oh dear. What is this? Brain! Brain, where are you? Uh-oh. Uh -huh. Woven. This is an emergency. Besides, I trust Damien. Let's go. Dang. Alrighty, I'm gonna leave it here and continue in the next one. I'll probably make this into three parts total. But we'll see. So thank you so, so much for joining me. This has been like a lot more things are um, being uncovered and kind of, I don't know, broken down and explained. This is getting very interesting. I'm very much looking forward to continuing. Um, thank you so, so much for watching. As always, thank you so much to everyone who contributed to this incredible piece of work. And yeah, I'm very, very excited to continue. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!